Is our desire to help our children taking away their independence? Find out today at Dyslexic and Unstoppable. Hi, it's Dr. Doug Curtis. And you see Curtis from Dyslexic and Unstoppable. Our mission is to help dyslexics rediscover their inner power. That's right. Today we'd like to talk to you about a gift you can give your child. And that's that gift of independence that allows them to take risks and not be afraid of failure. Um, and we've tried to really instill that in our children. Um, maybe you can talk about from our perspective. Well, I think that um, children are smart, creative, um, more uh, able than we let give them a chance to. And mm. I feel that our new... Our society is so competitive that they don't even take some, not everybody, but a lot of times parents are too involved mm -hmm. in the process of their homework, their projects and that. And it becomes the parent's project, not the children's project. And I think it disempowers the children right. because then they think that they, they don't get the satisfaction or the, the drive or the need or the want to figure it out and make mistakes along the way and figure out what works and what doesn't work because mm -hmm. it's the ideas are already put in place for them. Right. And I, I think it all comes from a parent's desire to do what's best for their child. Like you yeah. think, you think, let me help him. I know that we together we can make this project extra great. Um, but in the end, not only does it, is it not really their project, but it's, it takes away that feeling of, hey, I did this. Look at what I did, you know? And then when they're met with a struggle in the future, they're always like, well, maybe I need mom or dad to help me with this, you know? Mm -hmm. Whereas if you allow them to do their own thing and uh, maybe make a mistake, maybe, you know, make it, maybe make it great, but just different from how mm -hmm. you imagined it, yeah. um, then they learn, hey, I can try new things. And if it doesn't work out, I can mm -hmm. go back and try it again. Yeah, you know? even with, with our son, like, uh, he learned a lot of great uh, methods of learning when he was in, re in reading classes mm -hmm. and how to study and things like that. And even like at the beginning of the year, he, he had um, started the year in, in a certain way of studying and he realized, whoa, this is not my the best way. And I, we had nothing to do with it. He realized it himself. Oh, I need to study more like this. And, and even on his report card, the teacher notice that you know he was able to find the best way for him to study to get the best grade available mm. the best grade for him and he did fantastic but he did it on his own because he we let him find his independence as a student which is what it's supposed to when i was little my parents didn't do my homework right, right? Mm -hmm. so yes you need to help them learn uh, give them methods how to learn and mm. how to set up and how to, you know, do things. But in the end, they really need to do their homework themselves right. so that they can grow into the person that they need to be. Right, exactly. So let us know how you're going to make your child independent, what, what you're going to do to, you know, instill that spirit in them. Uh, leave us a comment below and visit us at Dyslexic and Unstoppable. Thank you. Thanks.